What's up everybody, Maddie Mo here, and today we're we'll gonna be talking about how to find your mobile device or tablet. Now we all know that the iPhone has the Find My iPhone service, and the Android version is called Android Device Manager. The name is not as catchy, but it pretty much does the same thing. I'm gonna show you two ways to find your lost or stolen Android device. One is by using your desktop browser, and the other method is by using your mobile phone. So without no further delays, let's start off with finding it by using your desktop browser. The first thing we need to do is load up an internet browser. Once you've done that, go ahead and log into your Gmail account. After that's done, go to www.google.ca and type in Android Device Manager. It should be the second search result that pops up on your screen. Go ahead and click on it. Once you've done that, you'll be prompted to select the device that's associated with your Gmail account. After that's done, it'll begin searching for it. Once it's found your device, it will give you a few options. You can either ring the device, lock the device, or erase the device. Now, if you do decide to erase the device, it will completely wipe everything on it. So only do this if you know for sure your, sto your phone has been stolen. Now, the second way to find your mobile phone or tablet device is by using another Android phone or tablet device. So whether you're at your friend's house and you don't have a computer there, you can use their phone to find your device that's been stolen or lost. So all you have to do is go to the Play Store and download the app Android Device Manager. After you install it, open it up and it'll ask you to enter your Gmail credentials. After you enter your Gmail credentials, it will prompt you to select the device that you're looking for, or the device that's associated with your account, rather. After you've, after you've selected the device that's associated with your account, it'll begin searching for it. Once you search for it and find the device, it'll present you with the same options as you had on the desktop version. You can ring the device, lock the device, and erase the device. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please feel free to give it a thumbs up. Also feel free to share or embed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one.